I see messages, well, well intentioned, you know, I'm not going to diss you if you've been writing a message like this. 2016 is over. Thank God. 2017. Can't wait. And I feel like psychologically it gives you the impression or the idea that a new year magically fixes your problems or your failures that came before. When I look at the, you know, what's happening online and everyone is like, 2016, this person died, that person died, it was bad, it was macabre, these horrible things happened, and I can't wait for 2017. And I just get a sense of deja vu. That's exactly what everybody was writing before 2016. And 2016 was supposed to be the magical year, and it turned out to be really crap, according right. to some people, right? right. Can so you I, say that on YouTube, that word? Crap? Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you can. Maybe say pigeon poo. <laughs> it turned out to be really pigeon poo. Yeah. But my point is this, right? What about if we just decided that it wasn't about time? Mm -hmm. And it was about our lives and learning to make decisions that are consistent and that will be better for us. So you're saying um, let's not tie our decisions or our good habits or our renewed energy to mm. a new year. Yes, because then you become a victim to what that new year brings. Because people always say that, right? Oh, let me see what 2016 brings, 2017 brings. That, that. I used to say that a lot, you know, let's see what this new year brings. And I realized that's actually a really dangerous attitude because it's a passenger seat attitude. Mm -hmm. And the driver in your life becomes your job, yeah. becomes the economy, becomes literally anything else that feels like it wants to be an influence into your life. Or is an influence. Because let's face it, your job and the economy will always be influences yes. in your life. So will your family. Yes. But you know, most people don't even think, what do I want my family to be like this year or to achieve this year? How do I want my family members to see me or do I want to make extra steps to make more time for mm -hmm. them? And it's amazing if you don't interrogate these things and you will have the kind of life that life gives you. Yes. As yes. opposed to the kind of life that, that you want. And it's you possible want. and it's like a muscle. The moment you start to see that, oh, I have this thought, I'm going to do this. Not, let me see what my boss has in store for me. Maybe my boss will give me a raise. But you've got to do things to deserve that raise. So it, it's or even to make the step to ask to, for it. Absolutely. But don't just, please don't, I'm an employer, don't just ask for raises like without any it, it really justification. It really bothers me. Yes, yes. And then you ask, like, this is off tangent, I'm oh, sorry. Okay, you're going on a dog yeah, leg. No, no, I have to talk about this we'll one. We'll have a therapy you know, you know, session. You know this one of, why should I pay you more? I moved house. <laughs> <laughs> I live further than I used to. Uh, okay. Sorry. Don't say, yeah, you were saying. Yeah. Bottom line is... I think the bottom line is, uh, I saw this somewhere, you know, the best way to predict the future is to create it. Yeah. And there's, there's nothing truer than that. Yeah. If you want a good 2017, make it a good 2017. But not just in January. You, how do you create things consistently? You don't create things like, well, even God took how many days, right? He didn't just say, boom, bam, there, everything. Well, he did. <laughs> <laughs> no, it took him seven days, though. Okay. He could have done it in one. But, you know, he had to take his time and say, okay, today it's the sun, tomorrow it's this. So if God, in all his infinite wisdom and power and excellence, can do it in a contracted period of time, you're not going to just do it in January. You've got to say January and then check up in February and then in March. And it becomes a habit in your life that you're consistently making resolutions, not just in the new year. Right. Important. When they need to be made and mm -hmm. when they'll have the most impact. Yes. So yes, um, take charge of your life. Don't wait for the year to decide where you're going to go. But of having course. said all that, Happy, Happy New Year! year. Woo, party poppers and all those things.